Hi guys, welcome back. Skellink here, and we're off for more of Mother Slash Earthbound Beginnings. In the last episode, we took out the entire of, entirety of Duncan's factory, clearing it all out, getting through there after a bit of kerfuffle at the start, getting lost and looking at maps because the place is humongous, it's confusing, and everything looks the same. And in this episode, well, we're not in the same place because we finished the last episode of Magic Ant. Like I said, I would have got back to Marysville, which I have done because I'm in the. Uh, Marysville department store off screen and any changes I will note now and that's what we're going to do so let me go to the stats first first of all Nintendo has got a level up and has learnt PSI healing oh um no I was about to say Omega then that's not correct Gamma that's not an R that's a very fancy Y so it's just sprite limitations that keep it from being a full symbol so yeah, it looks like a fancy R, but it's actually a fancy Y. So yeah, it's, it's PSI healing, um... I have to always pause before I say it. Gamma. You know, it's not, is it Gamma? Yeah, it is definitely Gamma. So, yeah, that's that. And, well, both Nintendo and Lloyd have a gold ring. Now, I can't remember if I mentioned this already, so I'm gonna... I think I just caught my headphone jack. That was weird. Anyway, um, yeah. Equipment is split up into four separate areas. You've got your weapon, you've got your coin, you've got your ring, and then you've got an accessory. Coins and rings give you ex give you pretty much defensive power-ups in two different slots. And obviously, the accessory, well, it does what it tells you, and they're interchangeable because they're not going to be trumped. Magic coin and gold ring are the best co uh, coins and rings available, but the repel ring doesn't do anything to defense, but uh, it doubles the steps that you have into next uh random encounter, which obviously I'm not going to be using because we can just use the pause method if need be. Plus we need to keep finding anyway because we need experience. And yeah, you buy almost all your defensive upgrades in Magican. Unless you find them elsewhere, you always get them in Magican. Seriously, we got the best coin and the best ring. That's it. That's what I did. And to get the gold ring for both Nintendo and Lloyd, I pretty much had to clear out my entire bank account and buy it and then I had like this much money left on me. 1683. But obviously, I killed a few enemies on the way here, which got me my level up, and obviously, that gave me a few more money in the in the uh, ATM. So that's a thing, and hopefully, this episode is going to be a lot more professional than it was last time, but I couldn't help that. In fact, this is the second recording because I had to try about five minutes, and I kept getting called like 10 seconds every time, even though about two hours before I started recording, I wasn't getting called at all, so my luck is just insane. Now, I believe, obviously, we've destroyed the rocks at the top of this area, so we can actually go to the train station and get on a train. But, if you remember, you can do that because you blow the... You use the rocket in Duncan's factory to blow up the rocks, and that's how we get through. But, I never actually went into the, um, tunnel. And this could possibly kill us. But the thing is, you don't really want to go into the tunnel because, obviously, it's going to be really tough enemies in there. I'm not kidding. They're going to be really tough enemies. So, um, yeah, that's why they want you to take the train. So if you don't take the train, you will go, you're going to be pretty much putting yourself in harm's way. And obviously you don't want that. You want an easy time through. So the very tough enemies that are, like, way over our level in the uh, train tunnel are pretty much there to prevent us from skipping the game, but we can if we can be through. So you don't have to get the train, I don't think. So you can just walk from each train station to the next. I don't know if taking the train from another place back to Marysville does anything. Maybe they'll stop before the rocks, but I don't know. So that's a thing. But anyway, uh, Lloyd advances to the next level. Fire's increased by 3. Speed is increased by 1. Wisdom is increased by 3. Strength is increased by 2. Force is increased by 1. Maximum HP is, HP is increased by 3. Eh, not terrible, but not great as well. And the exact same bell? Yep, the exact same bell. Okay, I'm going to run because we need to... Yeah, we can run away from a car. That's how badass we are. Okay. I'm going to try and abuse this pause feature if possible because we're not going to take out the enemies in the tunnel. We're probably going to have to spam freaking PSI uh, fourth dimension slip. But these guys are not a hassle. We can one-shot these guys. So. I should have targeted the other guy with Lloyd. Such a nub. So I just wasted Lloyd's attack. I hate that. Uh, the joys of old RPGs, they don't have auto-targeting when an enemy falls. Or an enemy that you're already targeting has fallen. Okay. Because there are very tough enemies in here, but if we go a certain way, the game will actually warn us to not pu push on. Scorpion. This thing can poison us, I believe. So, let's life up on Lloyd. And then, 
Have I got a, have I got a bottle of rocket I could use? I think I should do that. Let's do it. Let's get some experience. Dodge swiftly. Life up alpha on Lloyd. There we go, 22 HP. That's not the best. We still need a better one. Suffered 21 damage. Okay, so that wasn't good. Let's fight, fight. Poison needle! There was no effect. Good, good, good. Okay. Oh, we get to move first this time. And we killed it! Wow, that thing was not tough at all. I wasted the bottle rocket. Oh well. Push onwards. Keep using the items. Uh, menus even. Because if we go halfway through this, the game will give us a warning. Oh my god, really? Every time I exit... Oh, rattlesnake. Let's just whack it. It's only one enemy. Last blow! Whoa! Holy shit! Did you see that damage? I can't fourth these slip now. I'm screwed. <laughs> My God! Hundred like, immediately the battle just started, and he killed himself to do that much damage. It wasn't like a self destruct or anything. He just did like a final blow or something. It did that much damage and exhausted himself, making him leave the battle. Did Lloyd even get an experience for that? I wasn't paying attention. Wow! I am scared. I might have to use the Onyx hook again, or I might get a game over. I don't know what's going to happen. Keep pausing every couple of steps. I need to reach this thing. I can't go back. There we are. There it is. There it is. There it is. I've got to keep doing this on the way there, though. Here it is. Here it is. Here it is. Okay. Turn down. For what? Talk to it. Get on the train, or you will have a hard time like me. Yeah. <laughs> I wish you could have told me that. I, like, at least a screen and a half back. Even though I already knew. Yeah, the game warns you. <laughs> a little bit of warmy game, you just wreck Nintendo. I don't think Nintendo's gonna be the same ever again, getting wrecked like that by a rattlesnake. So yeah, he says get on the train or you'll have a hard time like me. And funnily enough, when you take the train, he's no longer there. For some reason all sprites despawn, other than the train, when you're going. So this is considered like an NPC sprite, so all NPC sprite. Other than the train, disappear when you're coming through the tunnel. So that's interesting. Uh, where are we on the map right now? Can I not check that? Yeah, it's not on the map. <laughs> okay. Um, I'm gonna die on the way back here. I know it. So <laughs> I feel like I should. Oh god, here we go. Ultra Barbot. I'm dead. I am so dead. I'm not gonna be able to run from this guy. Twenty-three damage. It didn't work out. I'm dead. I'm done. I'm so done. PK Beam! Oh, I have I have the Franklin badge! Oh, but you can't get hurt by it. Okay. Well, could you please spam spam that so I can try to get out of this battle? Because I'm not going to be able to kill you with Lloyd. <laughs> I knew this was a stupid thing! Okay, I actually got out of there. If uh, <sighs> I'm going to lose half my money if I get a game over, though. You know what, guys? I know what I'm going to do. I'm going to use... Right, I've showed you what I want to show you. I'm gonna go use the onyx hook. Wait, I can't use it. I can't. I can't go up. Oh my God. All right, I'm gonna have to give that to Lloyd, and then I'm gonna have to good goods. Okay, so what I'm gonna have to do here is I'm gonna have to use the onyx hook to get the hell out of there. I was originally going to show you that and then get out with 4th D slip, just spam that, just to get back to Marysville, but apparently Nintendo had to get smashed by a rattlesnake of all things, I've never seen that happen before. So, not even in Chugger's LP, because he never bumped into that in the... Actually, I think he got really lucky and went through the whole train tunnel up to the skeleton just to show that off and got back out without any encounters, even though he cut a few out, but I would think that he would have shown that much damage output, but... Nope! And that took me by surprise, so... Let's heal here quickly. Let's heal Lloyd up, and then... Because I'm not losing half my money right now. And then Nintendo's fully healed. You are fine once again. Give the Onyx hook back. To Nintendo. And I'm going to have to cut back to Marysville again. So if I get any other stuff off screen, I'll let you know, of course, because this is recording. So I'll see you guys in a bit. Good God! 198 damage! Just all of a sudden! The game really does not want you to skip that area. It, like, punishes you but gives you a chance. And I can never remember the pattern in here. I can never remember the bloody pattern in here. I'm so useless. I'm so useless. 
And we are back. Okay, so <laughs> I didn't exactly get any level ups there. In fact, I got a bit of a bad habit of running from fights when I'm just backtracking. Especially when every time you go back to Magic Ant, you have to walk back to Marysville or to your previous destination. It would be so nice if we had a fast travel feature, but we don't have that at the moment. So let's talk and save for now, because that was ridiculous. We got 499, I think that's because of the Grouchos that ran away from me and said hello and stuff. So, yeah, that's a thing. No one's close to a level up at the moment, so might as well save. Do, do, be, do, be, do, 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 do. Continue. Now, you want to make sure that you have at least, um... I can't remember the um, I can't remember the amount that's in the walkthrough, so I'll just say keep just have some money on you, somewhere around like over 100 or something, maybe 200. I don't know. I always keep money on me, but right now I've just got pretty much my entire bank account on me, like I said, because of stuff. So I'll just run along these train tracks and apparently not get into a battle. Ah, and there's that rocket that we bumped into. Uh, can we check it? Can we check the rubble? No problem. Okay then. So we're not going to make mention of the thing that we just blew up. Look at these train tracks, seriously. And here's the station! There's nothing else around here, I believe. So let's go just walk in here, I guess. Hello! Oh. I went to talk. When I want to check, I talk. When I want to talk, I check. What's the matter with me? I heard that on the radio that it's a mess everywhere. At all costs, I will protect this station. What are you going to do about it? Anyway, yes, we need money for obviously paying for train tickets, so I'm going to get a free ride. What are you, crazy? This game's like, like that. Uh, talk to you, buddy. Well, I don't know how far the train goes through, but you need to take it a ride. Care to buy one? Uh, yeah, I believe we need to go to Reindeer first. We don't want to go to Spookane. Yeah, you can see that the price gets higher and higher. And I believe that it's 16 times the amount of pipe members you have. I'm not too sure. Either that or it actually displays the price you need. I guess we'll find out when we pay for reindeer. Yeah, it's times two the amount. So a ticket is 16, but because there's two of us in the party, it's 32. See how it works? Gotta keep mention of that. So let's do that. Okay, that was weird. I had to press A twice. Whoa, we're going fast! Gotta go fast, whoa! <laughs> Everything's just zooming away. And I like how smooth it is on older consoles, and notice that the bone's not going to be here when we're going through here. Yeah, like I said, I, I like how smooth NES games are. They, In fact, people think that 60 frames per second is a big thing today, in today's days or whatever, even though obviously recording in my way is like, because this is a Roxio, not an Elgato 60 FPS or whatever, I, I can only record in 30 frames, but it's do six. Yeah, what am I trying to say here? NES games actually run in 60 frames per second. I'm not kidding. They actually, that's why they look so smooth. But anyway, we made it. So let's go have a look around here. Hello? Are you going to Snowman? Yes. I found this hat. I believe it's a property of a girl who lives there. Take it to her. I gave her an old man for, whoa. Okay, we just got a key item. Let's have a look. Hat. A pretty hat embroidered with the name Anna. <gasps> is it the Anna that is supposed to be a member of our party? What we named at the beginning of the game before the intro? That means if we go to Snowman, we get a new party member. Screw Reindeer for now. We're going there. Yep. You can explore Reindeer for now. There's not much to do here, but we might as well come back when we have more party members because, you know, more party members means more power. And remember what I said. Anna's the one with all the offensive PSI. We need her badly, <laughs> as we've already known. So let's go talk to this guy now and continue on to Snowman. No, 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 I don't want to go to Union Station. That sounds like something out of Kingdom Hearts. Even though it's called Sunset Station. It sounds similar, right? Alright, uh, Snowman, please. It's actually cheaper because we're close to the destination. Ba bam And we get to ride this nice, smooth train track again. I guess if you... I guess you could possibly just run across these bridges. Is this just a straight on line? Well, that's Spookane, because we didn't pass anything else on the way to Reindeer, and Spookane was in the middle of the two selections. So that must have been Spookane we passed through. Once again, we know another tunnel that they expect you to take the train for, so you're probably going to get murdered by enemies once again, and now we're at the end of the line! Wow, that was quick. Ooh, this is the music. Very nice and atmospheric. So we'll have a nice listen to it in a second. Let's go talk to the locals for now. Mum left for Youngtown. 
We haven't heard from her for days now. Dad and I are going there to look for her. Youngtown? When I was on my way to Youngtown, to, I was on my way to Youngtown to look for my wife. But without the train running, how can I get there? Yeah, you can't get to, um... You cannot get to, um, Youngtown through the, with the train, or in the direction of Youngtown through the train, because at, outside Union Station, not only was it blocked off by boulders on one end, but the bridge just beyond it is broken. So, yeah. So, if you don't recognize... So, I will just let you listen to this tune for a minute. music, isn't it? In fact, that little, that, that, well, this bit, as well as the other bit, was, uh, is actually part of the theme in, uh, certain stages on Brawl and Melee and, well, just in the Smash series in general, so that's pretty funny. Anyway, this is a this is a convoyant who's still in training, but she thinks that we'll have to return to Union Station, which we've already established that we're gonna have to do that, but she's not completely sure. So she just states the obvious a little. But, when you're in an NES game, that's also an RPG. You need all the help you can get, especially when it comes to tips like that. Oh god, this is bad. This is bad. Okay, obviously we're going against snow enemies that are weak to PSI fire, but we haven't got any effects of PSI yet. However, we have got a bomb. We have got a bomb which is PSI fire for Lloyd, but it's only one use. And uh, I don't think we're going to be able to run away from a pack of wolves. There's way too many enemies here, and this is like the max amount. And wolves can be devastating. So, um, I'm a little worried, <laughs> to say the least. So let's defense up on Alpha on Lloyd for now, and Lloyd can just chuck a bomb out there, I guess. So let's do that. Do okay, so we need all the defense that we can have. Oh, they're attacking Lloyd! Okay, they Lloyd's taking no damage at the moment, and Nintendo's fast enough to dodge, so that's cool. Nintendo took nine. Okay, this could be bad, because they keep stacking that. 60, 57, 58, 57. Okay, so a 57 on average and it killed none of them. Great. Alright, what we want to do now is get another P uh, defense life up on the 10. Basically, we want to try and avoid these battles if possible, but I'm just seeing if I can do this for some great experience. So let's defense up on ourselves. We got the PP for it, so we're fine with that. Um, let's just shoot this other wolf A, I guess, because they should be weak enough for us just to finish them off. Whoa! Defense up by 91 for the 10. Why could I not be for Lloyd when he's lower level? He could actually use that extra boost. I guess it's just luck of the random number generator. I rolled high. God, all of the 1 HP damages now. Smash! 53! Got it! Right, kill you please. Remember that we can go back to Duncan's factory to, to uh, get some bombs for free if we need to, because we didn't grab every item over there, I don't think. I think we missed quite a few bottle rockets and bombs. So, let's have Nintendo attack the first wolf and Lloyd take attack the second wolf. So then Nintendo got a smash for 72. So we're almost done here, taking like no damage at all. There we go. Oh, only 12 free. Couldn't have got a smash. There we go, done. Nintendo obviously still does more damage than Lloyd, about double the amount. Good lord. Anyway, that battle was done. So let's... Oh, hello. Looks like we're in town. We're in town! Oh, 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 okay, 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 I just remembered. Don't talk to people in blue, they're gonna give us a cold. Um... Jack? I can't check the sign, it just says Jack. Hello? Oh, check her out. Welcome! Oh, she's an inn! Oh, well, we don't need to do that for now, I guess. Okay, so this is the inn of the place. That's why it says Jack, I guess. What's this place there? Oh, it's a mini store. Cool. Oh, don't check! I keep doing that. Now I'm doing it the other way round. Every time it's a present, I, I say talk, and when it's a human, I say check. I've got to get that the other way round. Frying pan! Well, <laughs> life of cream, that's cool. That's pretty much a full heal right there. There's an ATM machine in here as well, but there is no phone. I could, can I talk to you? Oh, I'm doing it again! Check, good lord. 
My grandfather lives in Yucca Desert. If you see him, please say hello for me. Hmm. Alrighty then. Can't go in there. Can't go to any of these houses, actually. Look at this. Can I talk to you? You look fine. Life is a game, but sometimes you have to rest. Breaking the fourth wall much? Earthbound humour. <laughs> nope, don't go in the menu. We'll talk to this old lady. Anna's house is a chateau, not a mansion. But I bet you already knew that. How? I don't know her. <laughs> uh, can I talk to you, cool dude? Please say hello to the camel's bones in Yucca Desert. I knew that camel once upon a time. You want me to talk to a dead... Okay. Just the bones, not like a burial site or something? Okay, whatever. Oh my, your nose is running. I'm not affected by a status problem. What are you talking about, lady? Because if you talk to the blue pe people, the blue sprite coloured people in this town, most of them will be having a cold and they will infect you. I mean, there is a blue head healer here to give you uh, remedies as well as other stuff, but that's a thing. Anyway, there's a free heal here. Oh, oh, excuse me, I need to see the person playing this game. I was about to save just to make a checkpoint. Oh, okay, fine. Hello there. I appreciate your kindness, turn 10. Oh, cheers. Even though I did send him into harm's way a second ago, but we got out of there. <laughs> I'm the boy's dad. Could you please let me know your name? Thank you for your cooperation. Um, sure. Uh, my name... Oh, I can only do it in capitals. All right. My name is Skatlink. God, it takes forever to move around here. Because I, I can't... Oh, yeah, I can hold the button. Okay, then. It's just that tapping it seems to be faster. Do I make a space? Yeah, I can. I can just choose one of those gaps. Okay. That's a bit weird, though, having two available for that. Oh, well. I'll type in my full channel name. How about that? Because it gives me the option to do so. I might as well use up the spaces. Are you sure that is spelled correctly? Yes. Thank you for spending your time with me. I, too, have urgent things to do, so I better go now. Slam! Well, we don't get a chance to save, so let's do that again. I don't know what that was about. Or do I? Mm -hmm. Anyway. Let's just make another save point here. And uh, we're at 27 minutes, but I've got to chop up about five of that. So I guess we could push on a little bit longer. If we don't make it all the way, I guess we could just... Mm. You know what? Now, nah, I'm going to end it here. We're going to make another episode. We've read the uh, we've read the train. We've got a few things done. I even showed you that secret little message. And Nintendo's dad talked to us, so I guess that was kind of eventful. And I just saved here, so I think we're going to make it here because we don't get to s stop at a phone very often. So, in the next episode, guys, we're going to go all the way to the Chatier of Snowman and uh, return Anna's hat to her, and hopefully she'll join our party. See you guys, then!